Welcome back, nerds, for another round with Nancy and Secrets Can Kill. Okay, Remastered Edition. So, uh, last time we were still hunting for all of the elements, and I ran around and looked at every single bulletin board everywhere, and I found the two elements that we were missing. Um, I also found uh, on one of the bulletin boards, there was an there's another sequence um, that I want to try to press on the pop machine. It didn't say what it was for, though. Um, and then another note talked about the fifth map drawer. And there were maps in the library. So before I do anything else with the elements, I still gotta go look up the order to put them in. Um, I want to try the pop machine. And the fifth map drawer is what the one note said. Um, Alright, so... I guess it doesn't really matter what pop machine I do it at, I don't think. I don't know what it does. Well, if it gets me in trouble, that's what second chance is for, right? Okay, so this one is cool, cool, pop, spot, and grape. Oh, I got one of the Easter eggs! Oh, this is so cool! This is what was on the inside of the Nancy Drew book, so the, the older ones. I have a few of them. I'll have to grab some of them for you guys and show you. Um, but yeah, that was what was on the inside. Excuse me? What happened? What was that? Was it chicken? Is there a chicken here? Alright, I'm not sure what happened. Okay, well, let me check that off. <laughs> so we did that one. Okay, I don't know what the chicken was. Maybe it was just because it was an egg. Okay, so now we gotta go to... Not there. The library. Uh, this is the same way. I am so bad at this direction thing. Okay, here's the library. Okay, so fifth fifth map oh, key so fifth map drawer the maps were over here they were over, here, over i think they were over here yeah maps one two three four five ah that's the last one n a Okay, so that is our last missing one. Is that all? 18? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18. So there we go. In that map drawer. Oh, what does this say? Hang on. Uh, what do I read? Just the red ones? If anything happens to me... Seer. Uh, oh, do I go back into the blue? S oh, search under my C O M B. Oh, oh, com com bon combine combo in. Okay, I got lost. Hang on. Search under my C O M B O combo in C A T cat A L O. Okay, hang on. I got it right. Under my. Oh, is it just. Wait. Hang on. So C. What is it? C. There, C O M B O combo I N C A T A L O G. Oh, combo and catalog. Oh, his locker combo in the catalog. In the catalog. Where's is this the catalog? This is isn't that the no. Hang on. 
Here we go. Okay, his locker com was 5253. 5253. Five, and go. Evidence. J. Rogers under my seat. Under his seat. <gasps> under his seat upstairs? Ooh. Ooh. So many clues. Okay, this is not. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Wait. I seen a coin. Hang on. There it is. Ah, I seen it. How many do I. 98 where'd I get where'd I get so many was that what that noise was from the egg okay so yeah oh oh and then the matchsticks had that m mercury where'd my matchsticks go here they are the mercury symbol yeah this one okay go away eh. oh wait I think I <laughs> I think this is where the, uh, this comes in. Okay, okay, so I still have a few left that I don't have numbers for. All right, so Na is sodium. Oh, here it is, 11. Hg, isn't that like, I used to know all these. HG. Where's that? Here it is. Oh, that's Mercury. And it's red because it's special. Uh, 80. Why is Urium? 39. And uh, TE. 52. ZR. This music sure does kick up, doesn't it? Zeronium 40. Alright, okay, so now I have all the numbers for the elements. Now I gotta put these in order. <sighs> Alright, um, let's see. Six. Oh, no. I have two. I have helium. I don't have hydrogen, I just have helium. Alright, okay, I need another page to do this. <laughs> Hang on. All right, so helium is two. Uh, all right, and then I wish I could show you guys my hot mess of notes I have going on right now. So I guess I'm going to have to look up what these symbols are for these elements and put them into the box. That's what I think, because I think there was a book that had all the symbols in it. So I think I have to get these in the right order and then find the book that goes with those symbols. So after that is carbon with six. And cross that these out as I go here. And then there's 11. Yeah, sodium with 11, left three. Um, 17 chlorine down to I'm assuming there's like a or, or maybe these are like the directions I go from mercury on the box maybe that's what it is maybe it's the directions I go from mercury maybe that's what it is then potassium I honestly don't know. It's been so long since I've played this game. I truly have no idea how to play it. Okay. Um, I think the next one is 30 then. Yeah, okay. Sink. Uh, 33. Any others in the 40s? Uh, 47. Yeah. Gold. Uh, 
Okay, so 50. I got fi oh, 52. Uh, this is the hard part of these mystery games. <laughs> Actually getting through the puzzles. 52, 53 is iodine, you too. 54 is xenon, R3. Uh, oh, 57. Well, there was a music shift for you. Which is the end one track and roll right into the next one. Um, okay, that column's done. Okay, what do I have left? I have 77, 72, 80. Okay, so 72, and 77, and where'd 80 go? Here's 80. Okay, all right, so I think I'm pretty sure I don't know. Let's try it. Let's just try looking at the box and let's just try following this. So we start at Mercury on the first one and then up to one, two, right? One, left three, one, two, three, down two, right one, down one, up four, two, three, four, left two, one, two, down three, one, two, three. Right four. So far, so good. Whew, down one. All right. Left three. Up two. Right three. Up two. Okay, still inside the board here. Left one. Whew, down. Uh, down how many? What was 77? I wrote the number weird. Two. Down two. Where's my mouse? Okay, one, two. Whew, almost lost that one. Left three. Oh, that did it! Oh, another VHS. Okay, okay. So apparently the killer's on this VHS is what some of the notes were saying. Remember it was like the the key to my killer is on the VHS or something. I don't know. But I wanna go watch this VHS. <laughs> Run, run, run. Come on. All right. Okay, so let's go home and watch this VHS. At least this music is less intense. All right. Oh, the beautiful static noise. Was it this one? This is, this is the story one? of a student council president gone terribly bad. Let's take a look at what kind of homework he's bringing home from Daddy's top secret military industrial aerospace factory. But what does Daryl do with this stuff? He's too stupid to really know what it all means. But he's not too stupid to know how much these industrial secrets are worth. You see, Daryl's selling out to our local air conditioning guy, Mitch Dillon. Uh -oh. Not sure what a guy specializing in HVAC does with satellite schematics, telemetry encodings, and signature intelligence, but I'm sure whatever it is, it's not exactly legal. But it's probably worth a lot of money to Mitch to keep it quiet. 6 p.m. Breaking news, check it out. I found out who Mitch is selling Daryl's secrets to. This dude, can you imagine? This dorkoid is what? the ringleader of some kind of clearinghouse for military secrets. And Mr. Clueless just forgot his journal full of important notes like contact numbers, system passwords, project code names, amounts paid, etc. Et I said I was looking for Jake's journal. And some journal. other stuff I don't understand, but I can tell that this guy will pay top dollar to get it back. But just in case, should anything happen to me, I'm putting the journal in a safe oh, no, place. No, it is Jake's journal. I taped it underneath one of the book carts at the school, but I doubt he'll give me much trouble. Just a ton of cash. So if you find this video, what? come look me up. I'll probably be long gone from Paseo del Mar and tanning my so body on my very own private island, retired at 17. I'm so confused. Aunt Eloise? Is that you? Turn off the TV, Nancy. Okay, so someone just entered. I don't remember this being... 
I don't remember this being the ending. This just seems weird. <gasps> Detective Z, I didn't expect you. Fancy. I just thought I'd come by Killing and see me. how you're doing. You seemed kind of in a hurry. Did you find the journal? Yes, I found your journal. My what? Uh, Jake's journal. I found Jake's journal. No, you said my journal. You said that you found my journal. Why don't we step into well, the living room and have a nice chat quickly. about where my journal is, hmm? Oh, and why don't you give me your cell phone? I'd hate to be interrupted during our little tete-a-tete. -tete. So, this so Detective many. Beach, an undercover assignment, so was just a ruse to that. get me to find your journal. What? You killed Jake, didn't you? Yes, my I did Eloise con you into this undercover charade, come. and you just ate this it up. This must be the new ending. I, mean, I knew you I... had the lingo, the self-important attitude. I heard there was a different ending. You're a real Snoopy Susie, aren't you? But as far as murder goes, no, that was my former partner, Mitch Dillon. But stop with this delaying tactic, Detective Nancy. Where's my journal? Oh, jeez. Okay, so where should I tell him? Uh, behind the tapestry, maybe? It's in the entrance, behind the tapestry. What's the combination? Oh, come on, let me go. Oh, uh, it was like Sigma Phi Kappa Delta, is that what it was? I have these notes. No. Yeah. Sigma Phi Kappa Delta. Or was I not supposed to tell It's him? not in here, and I'm tired of these tricks you're playing. Where's my journal? <sighs> You've tried my patience long enough. You leave me no choice but to find the journal on my own. No. <laughs> well. Knock, knock, who's there? Beach, Beach. Why didn't you get a chance to read the joke? Why does that go so fast? Yes, yeah, try Let's stop with this delaying tactic, Detective Nancy. Where's my journal? Okay, so where is their... Where's their journal? It's in the entrance, in the sofa, under the rose paintings. There has to be something I can Why do. Why me? Why did you choose me to go undercover? You fit the bill. You're a teenager, you're new in town, <laughs> and you're an amateur detective. I overheard your aunt talking about you at the diner and came up with the whole anything. undercover idea. I don't think the journal's here. Well, I'm going to give you another one. chance. Tell me where my journal is. Um, behind the mirror, behind the tapestry is not the answer. In the credenza drawer? It's in the entrance, in the credenza drawer. There's nowhere for me to go. I can't do anything. So, did Jake try to blackmail you after he found your journal at the diner? Excellent deduction, my dear Drew. Let me do something. That's why I sent Mitch after Jake. Ah! Up run, Nancy! Unfortunately for Jake and Mitch, the roughing up got a bit out of hand. No journal. I've been a very patient man, and I need my journal. Tell me where it is. I don't know where it is. the rose paintings. It's behind the rose paintings. How is Daryl involved? He was selling off his father's trade secrets to me via Mitch. Poor kid. This is he very had no weird. idea how valuable his information was. No journal. You've tried my patience long enough. You leave me no choice but to find the journal on my own. Get it. No. Grab it. Ah! Grab the gun. How do I? I don't. I don't. Good news. You're done with your case. Bad news is you're done as a detective. All right. Seriously. Seriously. Come on now. But stop with this delaying tactic, Detective Nancy. I'm Where's my journal? It's in the entrance behind the mirror. Come on. Who are you exactly if you're not a detective? Come Just on. a businessman, albeit an unconventional one. Come a on. A businessman who deals in top secret information that Something. certain governments and what? other parties I don't, are interested I don't in. get it. I don't. 
It's not in here. I'm going to give you another chance. Tell me where my journal is. I don't know. I don't understand. It's in the entrance, in the sofa, under the rose paintings. Obviously, I'm missing something. Why me? Why did you choose me to go undercover? You fit the bill. You're a teenager, you're new in town, and you're an amateur detective. I overheard Where? your aunt talking about you at the How? diner and came up with the whole undercover idea. No journal. I've been a very patient man, and I need my journal. Tell me where it is. <sighs> it's in the credenza drawer. Am I just buying time? Like, what so, is my goal with this? So, did Jake try to blackmail you like, after I you found your journal at the diner? <laughs> I don't understand. Excellent deduction, my dear Drew. What That's am I supposed I to do? Jake to rough him up a bit. Am I just getting the story? Unfortunately for Jake and Mitch, the roughing up got a bit out of hand. No journal, Nancy. You've tried my patience long enough. You leave me no choice but to I find don't. the journal on my own. No, I don't know what to do. I don't get it. I don't get it. What am I supposed to do? What do you what what but stop with this delaying tactic detective Nancy. Where's my journal? <sighs> it's in the entrance in the credenza drawer. I don't get it. I'm lost. I don't know what to do. So, did Jake try to blackmail you after he found your journal at the diner? Excellent deduction, my dear Drew. That's why I sent Mitch out to Jake. Oh, we to already him up. heard this. What am I supposed to do? Unfortunately for Jake and Mitch, the rough The struggle. Up the struggle is real. I truly I don't, don't know what to do here. right now. I don't I know it's not. It's I'm under going the to give bookshelf. you another chance. Tell me where my journal is. I don't know what you want from me. It's in the entrance, behind the mirror. Like, am I missing Who something? are you exactly if you're not a detective? Just a businessman, albeit an unconventional one. Like, I don't have a anything. I mean, I can send them behind certain there. governments and other parties are interested um. in. No journal, Nancy. I I've don't... been a very patient man, I and know. I need my journal. Tell me where it is. Okay, well, the mirror one at least keeps him over there. So maybe now I say behind the tapestry, or do I say under the sofa, behind the rose it's paintings? It's behind the rose paintings. How is Daryl involved? He was selling off his oh, father's trade come trade on. Like, what am I supposed to do? He had no idea how valuable his information okay, was. Okay, okay, so... No journal. You've tried my patience long know. enough. You leave me no choice but to I'm find stuck. the journal on my own. I no! <laughs> Easily win the Nancy Sarah contest. Thanks, Nancy. All right, but Rose stop with this delaying bad. tactic, Detective Nancy. Go look behind Where's the my mirror. journal? It's in the entrance, behind the <sighs> mirror. Go break the mirror. I mean, I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to have him do. Who Maybe are you I'm exactly? If you're not a detective, to, like just a business buy time and run him in circles. Like I really don't know. Deals in top secret information I don't understand. I'm assuming this is end game. Are interested in. But like, I mean, you can see my no hot mess journal, of, of, of notes here. Like, I'm going what to am give I you supposed another to chance. do? Like, tell this, me where this, my like, journal uh, is. There's nothing. There's nothing on here. I don't understand. Um, go look in the drawer. It's in the entrance. Yes. In the credenza drawer. I'm so confused. So, did Jake try to blackmail you after he found your journal so... at the diner? Excellent deduction, my dear Drew. That's why I sent Mitch after Jake. Don't rough him get up it. it. Well, he did more and rough him up a bit. The roughing up got a bit, yeah, out, a bit of out of hand, hand as in no journal, Nancy. dead now. I've been a very patient man, and um, I need my journal. Tell me where it is. Under the sofa. It's in the sofa, under the rose paintings. Oh, oh, the dialogue. Why oh, me? I thought the dialogue why did you choose me to go undercover? You fit the bill. 
You're a teenager. All right. You're so new in after town, this, the other two detective. always end in I overheard in your aunt talking death. About you I don't. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Idea. I it's feel like I should here. be trying to do something. Oops. That's not what I wanted. You've tried my patience what do long I enough. Do? You leave me no choice but to find the journal on my own. No. I don't. I don't know. I honestly don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Well, um, I guess I'm going to have to go look this up. I think that that's what I will have to do. Because <laughs> I'm not sure what to do. I mean, I guess I can end it here and maybe I'll go look it up and think about it. Maybe it's something simple. Maybe I'm missing something. Maybe I forgot to get something and I've completely screwed myself. I have no idea. So, um, I will leave this one here and continue and try to figure out what I'm supposed to do. Um, I think I'm going to have to go look up a hint because I'm not sure. I feel like I forgot to do something. <laughs> and now I'm like stuck in this never ending loop. Like, this, I can't get to my items. I just... I don't know. Well, I guess that's it for this round. Hopefully I'll be able to figure out what we're supposed to do. And we can wrap up um, this 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 video game in the next video. I mean, I wanted to do it now. Maybe, maybe I can go... Go look it up. Let me go look it up here. Let's see what we got. Here we go. Let's see. Because I know that there has to be a walkthrough. Alright, so we are at the end game. Scroll, 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 scroll. I'm sure we got past all this. I did that. Um, replay with the wrong answer twice, only to get more info. The third wrong answer gets you hit in a second chance. Then respond the tape is behind the tapestry. Oh. Well, now I feel stupid. All right, give give second chance. Oh, no. Oh, there it is. But stop with this delaying tactic, Detective Nancy. Where's my journal? Okay, so they said to do it. It's in the entrance um, behind the mirror. Twice to get more information, and then who go are you exactly? If you're not a detective, wow, Just a that's a little man. weird. I forgot about Aunt Eloise notes that um, who deals in top incorrect combinations. That certain governments and set the thing off. Should have just did that the first time. <laughs> what the heck? No journal, Nancy. I'm going to give you another chance. Tell me where my journal All right, is. Alright, behind the tapestry. It's in the entrance, behind the tapestry. What's the combination? Uh, wrong one. Mu Pi Phi Zeta. Did that work? That's not it, Nancy. Zeta Mu Mu Pi. You're trying my patience, Detective Drew. What's the combination? All right. Kappa Lambda Kappa Sigma. Hey! What the? <laughs> I want to see what happened. Here, what Drew? happened? He's standing. I'm sure the police will be what? happy to transfer you <laughs> to another set from? of bars. So long, Detective Beach. And hello, prisoner Where? number four three two one. Did that just drop down out of the ceiling? Dear Dad, case I... closed. Mitch Dillon and his boss, <laughs> formerly known as Detective Beach, are on their way to prison. The police still don't know his real identity, but his trade in top secret information has been stopped thanks to Aunt Eloise's burglar proof safe. Daryl has it confessed to selling information about his father's military ceiling. projects. Despite the damage oh, this has no. caused Gray Enterprises, oh, Daryl's father has forgiven him. Oh. Honey returned her trophy, but the judo uh. club refused to take it and is opening All the right. competitions to women next year. That's good. Polk agreed to pay for the damages to the pharmacy, 
<laughs> and Pal has gotten his scholarships. Even though he played and dry. I'm to the beach, where the only cover I'm going to go under is a beach blanket. Oh, jeez. Nancy. All right. Oh, what was the name of the library? Oh, no. <laughs> um. Okay, was it Helen C. White? Was it Max Cade? I think it was Helen C. White. All right. Uh, oh, okay, so reaching the last level of Barnacle Blast, that would have been so... Grape, grape, orange, cool. Apparently, if I did that more than once, I would have got that. Oh, I got that question wrong. We buffling each <laughs> attempt by Daryl. All right. Burp, drink a lot of pop. Finding all the quarters, playing every jukebox song. Jacuz for confronting all those Weasley subjects. All right, well. Oh, I think this is a preview. Um, but I don't think it's for the next one that I we're going to play. I always wanted to visit Japan. From the exotic food and wild fashion in the cities. Me too, to the Nancy. nature and tradition in the smaller towns. Me too. I know there's going to be a ton to see and do. Yes. As a thank you for all of my hard detective work, P.G. Crowmeister has reserved a room for me at one of the area's best ryokans, or traditional inns. It'll be nice to finally take a break from solving mysteries and to spend a few weeks without danger and dark secrets hiding it's not in how your every life works. corner. It's not how your I've life works. I've already heard that the Ryokan I'm staying in has Spoiler quite a alert. It's a mystery. I'm not sure exactly for what, though. Well, I'll find that out soon enough. Oh! Yes, that's Shadow at a Water's Edge, I believe. That is not the next one we're going to be playing, though. Join me in my next adventure, Shadow at the Water's Edge. Yes, so that was the next one after this remastered edition um, came out. Um, we're not going to be playing Shadow at a Water's Edge next. Um, we're going to be doing them in order. So the next one is stay tuned for danger which was actually i think the first one i played um it was the very first one and i remember i got stuck and i actually remember precisely where i needed some red overlay to decode something and i didn't have the red overlay um <laughs> oh excuse me so hopefully this time i won't run into that problem and get stuck i got stuck for like weeks and weeks and weeks i was also like 10 but hey so, oh, that was good. Senior detective, which means I didn't have, like, a checklist or hints or anything. I think I did pretty good. I did have to look up the ending, though. So, I will admit to having to look up the ending. Fair enough. Um, but, uh, I had a lot of fun. Hopefully you guys did. Hopefully my, my wonderful scribble notes I have going on here. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and get to a new page and get ready to start the next game so I'm glad that they remastered this I heard there was a different ending um I don't remember what the first ending was but this one I know that they made it nicer they said like the other ending was too much um the original ending was too upsetting or sad or something maybe I don't I don't remember why maybe it was a suicide I think it was a suicide. I can't remember. It's been so long. So if you remember, if you want to tell me what the original Secrets Can Kill ending was, please put it in the comments for me. Help jog my memory. It has been quite a while. So. Hi, I'm Nancy um, Drew. Oh, shush, this Nancy. So uh, that's it for Secrets Can Kill. See you guys next time when we tackle Stay Tuned for Danger. Bye.